such a rainbow behind you. That's filming right now, eh? You know what? I was up here and I was like, holy moly, I see these three magical things. I'm like, should I go get a camera and take photos? I'm like, I'm just going to soak it in. And then here you go. So over here, there is a new day being born. Look at that. It's like an egg hatching out of the clouds. There's these big rays as the sun comes up. Right at the top of that peak, there's a little cloud. Just a little wisp around the very highest point of Tahiti. It's starting to windle away now. And then, well, the rainbow, you can just see it. But it was very visible before. It was coming straight out of the mast. And then the butt end of it, which you can land it on Morea. It's a very exciting day. Not only have we turned into a laundry emporium, what else did we get today? We got a replacement droney. What? Just drone, I guess you don't pronounce the E. And a huge thank you to Nirvana for allowing us to share their drone and use it the past few weeks. Two months. Two months. Bongo, are you happy? Oh, very good. It's been raining all day. It's a windy, blustery day and we're leaving Tahiti. Where are we going, Tommy? Maria. Maria! So it's quite windy. We've got Tommy in the V-berth. He's going to be laying the anchor chain so that it doesn't pile up into a big cone. He's stepped up and started doing that recently. It's been a huge help. And it's very windy, so we'll have Bentley midway relaying messages from bow to helm. Is everybody ready? I think we'll plan to go out on any pass, but this pass is much easier than any of the two motos, but I also don't want to take it, you know, think, ah, because there's a lot of wind. It's a bit of a wet one. This is amazing. Typically we'd have the wind from like right behind us now on this sail, but it's pumping out of the south. So now it's kind of a... <laughs> Boy, would you know, an upwind sail. Hilarious. <laughs> That's okay. There's Maria. Maria's just a stone's throw away. It's very close. We are gonna go all the way around the east side up to the north end. So it's about 20 miles. Oh, we only have 15 to go, Mick. We've already done five miles. Flying. All is well? Mm -hmm. Good stuff, dude. It's a very uh, well marked channel. Yeah. I can't believe we're here. Look at this. It's so stunning. What just happened? Just hit the bottom. Can you get on the radio, please, and just say we just broke the bottom? Stones is coming. Hello? What? Yeah, maybe 
maybe if these guys push your bow, then we can push your stick yeah. this way. Yeah. yeah, perfect. Where push do you want me, Nick? Yeah, push the bow that way. Right. Thank you. <laughs> Timing was just all wrong. Yeah. Like a, we, like we couldn't see the bottom. We weren't watching, and then all of a sudden a massive gust came and just pushed the nose, and I couldn't flick it around. By the time I flicked it around, we were on it. Well, that was pretty funny. I don't even know what to say. I wasn't doing a very good job standing at the bow, watching the for things, <laughs> because I was kind of running back and forth to talk to Mick in the cockpit, in, in the cockpit, in the cockpit, and then I'd run back to the bow and be watching our depth again and I just ran back at the wrong time it went from 50 feet to zero in under a boat length I would say we were not moving fast and I was like what's the depth and mix like counting down 14 10 like it was going so fast two zero and then it was like boof luckily it's it was a sandbar so no harm done but that was pretty funny yep Second one we've hit. I, my first. <laughs> it's a funny feeling, isn't it? It is. You don't even really it's feel soft. it. It's very soft. It's like... I'm so excited for what we're about to go do. What are we about to go do, Bentley? Um, what are we about to go do? Like a stock leg with the stingrays. Yes! There's this little area that is actually nicknamed Stingray City because all the stingrays hang out there and you can go and they're so friendly and they swim right up to you. Stingray City! And we're, uh, I am like so excited. I read about this in a book a long time ago and I just am so excited that we're here and we get to go experience it.
you kind of have to push them away. Whoa. I, I had a few times when they like were coming at me. They're like, look at them all. What did you think, Bentley? It was really cool. Really cool. Good morning! We're making a bit of a hasty exit here out of Aponahu Bay. Last night, what was it? Like 8 o'clock at night? 7 o'clock at night? It was dark. The police came by and said everyone needs to leave the bay. And that is fairly significant. There are three anchorages here. 40. 40 or 50 boats in one anchorage. There's about a dozen in that anchorage where we were. And we all have to leave and go somewhere. So, and before 8 a.m., that was the other thing. There's a race happening here today, which is super cool. Shame we didn't have a little bit more notice. So everybody kind of woke up early and the bay is really emptying out. The race is just this weekend, Saturday today. So we could come back on Monday. But we only have three weeks left in French Polynesia. Now we need to check out. Isn't that so crazy? The time's gone so fast. Beautiful anchorage after beautiful anchorage. Hey, let's try something at this anchorage. Let's not run into a sandbar. Boring. Are you ready to go explore? Yeah. Let's do it. I love the look of this place. There's a dinghy dock that's like named after the grocery store. So I wonder if the grocery store owns the dinghy dock, but that is pretty darn handy. Let's go check it out. Feeling town, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it sure is. is it so clean, though. Is it fruit market here? Hi. Hi, here? This is a great store. We had no plans to get anything. We've got a mini cart, so I can't wait to come back and load her up with our bags. Ooh, yummy! Found some cheap beer and baked beans and cheap cereal that's been hard to find too and Oops. Australian noodles was that successful yeah baguettes Morea was such a special stop for us filled with loads of boat friends beautiful scenery and topped off with a very special night out on the town with friends yeah. 